Hi guys, how are you? Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be on my empties. I almost forgot what was the name of this video. But today's video is going to be on my bag of empties. Here it is. This is my big gigantic bag of trash, basically. So if you want to know what's in this bag, please go ahead and stay tuned. Thank you. Okay, first of all, curly hair, don't care. Yes, my hair is naturally like this. I have naturally curly hair, but also naturally thin hair. So my curls will fool a lot of people thinking I have thick hair, which I don't. So yeah, and basically, bye-bye pixie because my hair really, really grew out. So if you want to, what should I say? If you want me to do a... Uh, grow out pixie video something like that please let me know in the comments down below i'll be happy to let you know how and what i did while my hair was growing out of the pixie cup okay okay that's another video anyway my empties i'm just gonna pull things out of here and let's just start because it's a lot and i don't want to make this video too too long the first thing I pull out of here is my Garnier. Yes, I still make that face when I say it because I can't say it without making the face. Um, Fruities, fortifying conditioner, sleek and shine. So this was for frizzy, dry, unmanageable hair. My hair is frizzy and it does get dry. Well, it is dry because since I chemically process it with doing highlights and, and dyeing it. But it was okay. It wasn't a big old major change. Like they claim three days of slickness. Um, it didn't. So yeah, I won't be buying this again. Okay, next I have this Suave Body Wash in Moroccan Infuse. Proven to silken skin as well as Moroccan oil shower gel. Well, I did get this. Um, I did that whole big couponing haul. Yeah, I got that then. And um, I do like the way it smells. It was okay. It wasn't better than my Olay body wash, but it was okay. It does smell really, really good. I do like the way it smells. Would I buy it again? Maybe. Yeah, it wasn't too, too bad, but I could see myself buying this again. Okay. With that, I actually, actually, <laughs> with that, I actually bought um, the Moroccan Infuse shampoo and conditioner. I still have the shampoo in my shower, but I did kill the conditioner because I always go through the conditioner bottles way faster than the shampoo. And I did like the way it made my hair feel. And it smells exactly like the body wash. It smells really, really good. Um, I do use oil in my hair, and I do like to use Moroccan oil. So, yeah, this actually helped my hair. It did give it a shine. Not a lot, but it helped a little. Will I buy this again? Yeah, I think I would. Okay. And, like always, I'm always chucking it to the floor. So, if you hear the banging, sorry. Okay, with that, I think I bought everything Moroccan, huh? I actually bought uh, the Suave Moroccan Infused Dry Shampoo. I did like this. I didn't, there's nothing, nothing left in here, but I didn't like the smell of it. It didn't smell like Moroccan oil. It smelled kind of funky. I like the way it worked in my hair. No, not really. I don't think I would buy this one again, but I would definitely buy the Moroccan Body Wash and the Shampoo and Conditioner. But this one, no, I don't think I will. Okay, next I finally, finally finished the L'Oreal Paris Advanced Hair Care Total Repair 5 Restoring Shampoo. Um, the last empties video I did, I went through the conditioner and the um, leave-in treatment or the repair, the repair treatment. And I love those and I did love this. Oh, it smells so good. I love the way this smells. Will I buy this again with the conditioner and the repair? Yes. Yes, I will. I did like how this made my hair feel. Okay. Next is something here that I got, and it's my son's, and he finished it. Yes, my son is 12, and he uses Axe. Yes, he does. He smells really good. And he's been wearing cologne and body spray since he was, like, maybe eight. My son smells like a man. 
Anyway, he finished his um, Axe Peace Scent Shampoo. And he said, why not put it in your empties? So I did. And he definitely liked it. So he said he would like to try another one. Maybe a different scent, but he definitely liked the Axe Shampoo. So this will be repurchased. Maybe in a different scent, but the whole Axe line he does love. So I will repurchase it for him. Okay, this is another body wash. It is my Soft Soap. Soft soap, soft soap, ultra rich shea butter and almond oil. Moisturizing body wash, leaves skin feeling smooth and soft. I did like it. It was okay. It did smell good, but compare this with the suave. I think this was actually better than the suave, but it was good. I liked the way it feel on me, and yeah, I probably would buy this one again. Okay. I have another swab product here. This is the Almond and Shea Butter Moisturizing Shampoo. Okay, this is for dry, damaged hair, and I love the way this smells. This ugh, smells good. I think I still have the conditioner in and the shower. I'm surprised that I do have the shampoo in the empties and not the conditioner. Hmm. Maybe I was using a different conditioner. Oh, no, because I bought, almost dropped it. I bought two of the conditioners and one of the shampoo. Because that's what I usually do because I go through the conditioner faster than the shampoo. But, yeah, I would definitely buy this with the conditioner again. Okay, almost there. I have um, some lashes that I'm actually chucking out, and they're from Kiss. I don't have the box to it, but they look like so. They are the number five lashes. They were pretty good, but it was hard for me to clean them. Um, and the lashes were coming out when I was cleaning them. But I did get a good amount of use off of these. I think I used these like maybe six times, which is not bad for a drugstore eyelash. Um, so yeah, I think I will buy these again, but in a different number. I want them to be more wispy. So definitely buy a kiss false lashes again definitely oh so sad it's such a sad day for me here in a love 22 land why because my model in a bottle finish no no let me tell you i have to buy me another one i love this stuff i mean i have a video and it's a review demo of this product if you want to know how I really feel about this product and why I have said it's a sad, sad day for me. I will link my review slash demo of this product down below so you can check that out and you can see why I love this setting spray and why I think this is the best setting spray out there. I'm going to miss you, but I'm going to replace you. Yes, I'm definitely going to order another one. Okay, let me see here I have... The Wet n Wild Eye Makeup Remover, it says oil free. And let me tell you, I liked this as a makeup remover, but not for my eyes. This sucker burns. It burns your eyes big time. I don't think I will be repurchasing this because it really, really burned my eyes. And if you see a difference in the light of this video, I just noticed the sun is really going down. It's kind of late doing this video, but I had to get it out there for you. And I love Wet n Wild, but that, mm, that's a no-no. Okay, and I got a couple of things left in here, so let me take out the bag and just rest it on top. I have the Hard Candy Button Your Lip Ultra Wet Lip Gloss. I had this, and I think my bestie bought it for me, and it came with a lip liner. But the actual lip gloss is coming out chunky, so I think it's expired, so I have to chuck it. So, yeah, but it was really good. I like this lip gloss. Okay, next thing I got here, this is my son. Uh, this is an imitation for Michael Jordan's cologne. And oh, it smells really good. And he actually finished it off. As you can see, there's nothing in here. Like I said, my son is 12. He smells like a man since he was 8. I love the way he smells. And he does not go to school without smelling like a man. <laughs> but um, he didn't really care for that being empty. So he didn't really want that one again. I have another one here. This is the Beverly Hills Polo Club Sport Cologne. And this one smells the best. And this is the one he loved. This is the one he killed, like, 
this in less than a month it was done so he definitely wants me to buy him this one again so this one will be repurchased okay so my second to last product is this pearless pearlis pearlis um hydrating balanced moisturizer for the face i love the way this worked on my skin i am super sensitive this didn't break me out or anything like that and i like the way it felt so i definitely want to repurchase this but the i guess the normal size container container or bottle or tube the normal size two for this it runs for fifty dollars and that's a little bit steep for me but i do have two more that i got from my ipsy bag and lip monthly so i have backups but yeah definitely love this okay my last product i have here is the super stay 10 stain lip gloss from maybelline and it is in the color i don't know because it's so small it says 190 my bestie gave me this and i liked it it stained really well but it's dry now so yeah but these are really good i think they got the new ones that last i think 16 hours now they're really really good i i like it i will definitely go out there and purchase another one well not another one i'll purchase one because she gave me this one okay so that was it nothing left in my bag that is my garbage of beauty products that i was holding just to show you so yeah, if you like this video, please go ahead and give me a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. And yeah, like always people, I love each and every single one of you. Bye-bye.